to my youtube channel it has been a fucking while i know i haven't posted on youtube i believe in like three months four months i am very disappointed in myself <laughs> honestly um and i just can't make any excuses i've just been uh kind of lazy and um just putting it off honestly and i'm very disappointed in myself but because my fingers I am going to be back on my shit. No more bullshit. No more. Not. No more. Okay. So, I hope everybody is okay during this quarantine or whatnot. I fucking hate it. But I kind of don't at the same time. <laughs> I mean, I hate it because, like, you know, we can't do anything. But at the same time, it's good. Because ain't no one finna get sick. And two is out of work. And we still getting paid for it. Mm -hmm. yes ma'am mm -hmm. um so today's video i'm going to show you guys how i keep my makeup organized in a small little section of mine in my room um don't judge me because i don't have a vanity i just honestly do my shit on the floor which I low-key prefer that. I don't know. I've just always preferred to do my makeup on the floor. I don't know why. Um, but yeah. I'm going to show you guys. I keep doing this shit. I don't know why. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to keep your makeup organized in a small little section like moi. Um, and I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell when I upload. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you on the other side. Bye. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to show you guys my little setup that I have. So, there is my impression vanities mirror. I have it right there. Oh, we are going to start off right here. By the way, I got this at the thrift store. Um, these, I believe, they're like usually $50. So I got it for, I think, $20 or $25, which that wasn't that bad to me because it was brand new. Like, it looked like it was barely used. So, yeah, I'd rather pay $20 or $25 than to pay $50. So, yeah, so always check out the thrift store because it's good. Um, all right. So, right here in this section right here, I have all of my setting sprays um all the way from the back like i have this uh cover fx and then i have a my Bideski, morphe my urban decay vitamin water um this iconic london prep set and glow i just broke it though like it fell and like just look at the way it skirts you see yeah i broke it <laughs> So I don't use it and it's like really good I have to try I'm gonna try to transfer it to like another one in one of these bottles when I finish it and then here is my um, Mac prep and prime setting spray mesh box prime water right here and then I have a couple of skincare stuff up here that don't fit in this drawer um, this is a Skin Fix Barrier Foam Oil Cleanser. This shit is good as fuck. And then I have some acne clearing pads. And then I have my um, Amazonian Clay Mask. This is good. The only thing is that if you have dry skin, you will get dry patches. So you have to be careful on that. And then I have some of my oils right here. Uh, see, this is glow recipe this is elms I have some toning water um, and then I have like this uh, little bottle of um, alcohol to disinfect my stuff or Marcel water I love this and then back here I got these cups at um, bargain hunt they be having some good ass shit on the low low um, and this is where I got this I think it's a four or four five cup i think i can't remember um but back here i have some brushes that i hardly use and then some face brushes that i will use every now and then 
and then here i have my um main base brushes here i have all of my blending brushes that i use every single day and then some pads and then what is this this is my day logica color swap cleanser and then i got my airpods on deck up in the beach all right so now moving on to the um thingy majiki whatever it's called so in the first drawer i have some drying lotion from my Badesky. um let's see i have some um uh protocolin marine cream right here um this glam glow mask this is my favorite mask right here got some bliss um some more glam glow some uh, Juicy Beauty. This is anti eye, anti wrinkle eye cream treatment. Um, let's see. <clears throat> we got my um, flawless. I love this thing so much. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Now that I can close it. Let's see what else. Uh, Oh, we have some more first aid beauty turmeric mask i love this and then some uh saturday skins waterfall glacier i'm not even gonna fucking focus saturday skin waterfall glacier i um moisturizing cream i love this some birch bee some more glam glow um some dr brand some more dr brand um, some face mask here at the bottom um, this is, let's see, what is this? This is Aesthetica's Pro Series Brush Cleanser and Conditioner. It's alright. I got this in my boxy charm, but if I was to buy it again, honestly, I wouldn't. So, that's my notes. I'm going to put this back in. Okay. So, we're not even going to go into the second drawer. This is just like a random drawer, and I'm pretty sure everybody does have one. So, third drawer is my eyelash drawer. So, we have some creme shop, some Betty B lashes, more lashes. These are, lashes are so freaking bomb. I'm just sad that the lash brand or the person who uses all these lashes is no longer in business. And they are so bomb. Like, I've had them for a year or two years already. And then don't go bad. We got some um, bad bitch, la bad bitch lashes. I got two pairs of those. Um, some Nicole Girl lashes that are somewhere. Some duo glue. Some backup kiss glue. We have some Cara Beauty lashes. We have some kiss lashes here. Um, some more lashes. Some Ardell lashes. Uh, and we got some more this is this brand is so good like if i was to recommend these to you i would get these nori they're from tj maxx and these these are wispies i have another another um two pack or whatever it's called in here these are so bomb and the creme shop they have some good lashes too and i was gonna wear them I was gonna wear them one time and I forgot what I went to do and I lost the other fucking pair. So now I'm on the hunt for Lolita. The only thing that is a downside to this um drawer drawer set or whatever is that sometimes it gets lopsided from like right here. That is the only thing, but it comes in handy. So then this drawer right here lipstick drawer i had it from like organized from like uh, what do you call it shit <laughs> um like a plumper and some uh fuck what do you call it exfoliators for your lips but that didn't fucking last long um so i have some Patrick star times mac some tart some dose of colors some uh chris uh dominique cosmetics got some anastasia lipsticks um steve stevie is so pretty i fucking love it 
some lattes, some mix, and some pro professional. Um, these are really pretty in like colors and stuff like that, but they are really, 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 really matte. Like they make your lips like get stuck together. That's the only downside. Um, I have some color pop, some Kat Von D, some Smashbox back there, some more dust of colors, Anastasia. Um, this Anastasia liquid lipstick set, which is freaking cool. And some makeup geek also, some Ofra, and some other more cosmetics. I just have like a ton of lipsticks. Like a couple of months ago, um, I cleaned out all of my uh, old makeup that I didn't use, some palettes that I didn't even use, and I gave some away, I threw some away, and I still have a shit ton of makeup. Yeah. So the fifth drawer, this is all of my foundations, my concealers, some extra powders, and my beauty blenders. Um, and my primers that I have in here. So back here I have some LA Girl Cosmetics. These are Pro Pigment Foundations, which I do make up people's makeup every now and then. Um, some backup foundations, some of this Fit Me, some Wet n Wild, um, this Milk Primer, which is blah. I have some more uh, Fit Me concealer, some NARS, some Tarte is my favorite foundation like if you want to splurge on yourself i highly 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 recommend this but then again if you don't need it you don't have to get it it's pretty much a dupe of the fit me foundation and this is like 30 something dollars and this is like leave like less than 10 dollars so there's a difference but if you want to splurge yourself i highly recommend the abh dewy foundation and then I have some Drew Avis, which I love some Drew Avis. Let's see, some I got some Wonder Beauty, some CoverGirl, uh, Dr. Brands. Let's see what else I have in here. I have Touch of Soul, which I love these oils. These are so bomb. These two, I highly, highly, highly recommend the Drew Avis. Um, I am Magic Foundation and Concealer. I recommend those. Those are so bomb. And then I have some Cover FX Powder. I have some uh, Derma Blend, which it is amazing. I love this. Love this. All right. Um. Anybody else just have like a shit ton of blender, beauty blenders? Um. I tried the beauty blender, and to be honest. I fucking hated it. That shit is hella stiff. And I got this one too. This is the Morphe sponge. And I also hated it. It's like way too stiff for me to like pounce on my face. And honestly, I just love the Real Techniques. Real Techniques is the best. And it's affordable. Alright, moving on. I have some mirrors in here. This is just like my um eyeliner mascaras um some eye liquid eyeshadows my glitters um, an extra blush some shavers and some what do you call it these little clippies for your hair it just has a little bit of everything mostly some eye stuff but like some stuff that didn't fit in this one i put in here um and i have some hank and henry some essence uh some um, mix eyeliners, the color eyeliners, this Essence uh, Brow Gel, which is bomb, some Stila liquid eyeshadow, some cover effects, these Ace Beauty ones, NYX, cover effects, um, highlighter droplets, I got some ABH, um, some ABH brow pomade, I got some Artist Couture, have some uh, powder or luminating luminate luminous loose blush and I have some Becca I just have like a little bit of everything my glitters this was like fucking steel this was like $4.99 at Ulta and then after Christmas I got it for 97 cents so that was a steal and then this is like the best eyeliner ever this does not come off at all this is from pretty well now moving on these last two these is these is this is where i have all of my palettes 
and what not. So as you can see, these motherfuckers are stuff. A little rundown. Um, I have some face. This is mainly face stuff right here that I have in this little back section. Um, this is the Dose of Colors Frankation Palette by Desi and um. Candy, this is the Let's Do Makeup palette, and all of this is my ABH palettes. All of this right here. Um, this is the Tarte um, Park Princess palette. Some more Too Faced, some Anastasia times Nicole, some Violet Ross, uh, the Daisy Marquez times BH. And here in this little section is where I have my bronzers and my blush. This is a physician's formula. Um, some Anastasia uh, blush trios, um, more blush. And then I have these two powder bronzers from ABH, which they are on. Moving on to the last drawer. Here is where I have mostly all of my big palettes. Where I have this is where I have my like my little palette. I got some Ju I got some Ju Avis. I got the Jacqueline Hill Times Morphe. I got some BH Cosmetics back here. The James Charles palette down there. Um, I got my Kat Von D um, Shade and Light Contour palette. I have some more um, Dominique Cosmetics. I have some. Uh, ColourPop is uh, with uh, Bretman Rock collection. I have some more Dose of Colors. And then I have some more um, Violet Voss right here. Like if you have it like really, really, really organized. And like I said, like you do a little cleaning and like look through your palette. See what you use and see what you don't use. Um, you have a hell of more space. And now here, this is the last place. This bag... To be honest, I forgot to where I got this bag. It was from like an influencer or whatever that you got it off or whatnot. Um, but I will look it up and see if I can still find it. If not, I'll just go on Amazon and link it down below in the comments. In the, comments, in the description box. But this little bag fits a lot. This little bag fits a lot, a lot of makeup in it. I should kind of stretch it out, but yeah, that's kind of a good thing. See, I told y'all, stretch that bitch out. <laughs> but this bag, in this bag, I have like pretty much all my everyday go to stuff. Um, mascara, my eyeliners, my um, brow pencils, and all that stuff. My um, lip liners that I use all the time. My go to ones, my ColourPop, um, Brown, Kiss, and all that good stuff. So. Down here, like I said, I have all my go-to, like my go-to primer, the Cover FX Blurring Primer, um, the Amorese Times Anastasia Highlighter, um, this Kat Von D Lolita. It's an eyeshadow, but I really love it as a blush. It is really cute. And then um, some concealers, a Tarte Shape Tape, um, the ColourPop No Filter, some more Too Faced, my go-to, <laughs> my go-to setting powder um, for Makeup Forever. Uh, my favorite um, primer from Too Faced is the hang, the major hangover. This is like the extra extra large one. And I got this at TJ. I got this at TJ for like I don't even think it was like twenty dollars. Maybe maybe not. I don't remember. But I know at Sephora this bitch is like fifty two dollars. So I'm telling y'all, TJ Maxx is worth it. And then my oh shit, <laughs> my uh, Becca. What is it called? Becca Hydro Mist Set and Reset uh, Setting Powder. Bomb as fuck. I got it from BoxyCharm. So. <laughs> so this is it. And I just keep it under here. For fast and grab and go. And here is where I have my little ring light set up. My mirrors back there. And all that cool stuff. If I'm all over the place, I'm sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. I forgot how to film. <laughs> I didn't even know how to do it in the first place. <laughs> this is how I keep all of my makeup organized in a small little itty bitty motherfucking place. <laughs> yeah, like I said, I highly suggest you guys investing in one if you have like a small section 
or or if you have a space big enough um to get a little um ikea ikea desk or vanity or whatever it's called from ikea um i think it's called the alexa alexa desk or something like that but i will link it down below either how um if you guys are interested in it i'm not gonna make anything off it i wish i did but i'm not okay i ain't there yet to make my little commission or whatnot <laughs> um but yeah i will link it down below maybe if i find this on amazon hopefully i can find it a little bit cheaper on amazon I will link it down below so you guys can see it and I will also link down below my ring lights I also got it from Amazon so I will link it down below and I hope you guys enjoyed the video I will try to get back on my fucking game especially now that everybody home I should have more fucking time to do videos so that is that so don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can know every single time I upload. I promise I will get back on my shit. I say that all the time, but I'm being dead ass serious this time. I'm dead ass. I need to stop being fucking lazy, okay? So, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time. Bye!